So check this out, everybody. This is a paddleboard, complete setup paddleboard by a company called Swander. Maybe the S is silent, Wander. And look at this cool looking bag. You get it in this bag right here, has a very nice straps on it, a padded back here. I feel like I could hike into a mountain with this. Has a waist strap on it, very high quality bag. Let me go ahead and open it up and show y'all exactly what you get. Loosen all of these up. You get a pump. That's the pump and the pump has an air gauge at the top, but we will not be needing this pump today because I have something special for y'all. And check this out. Here's the entire board right here, right there. You'll get a paddle, you get a leash, and I'll show you how this fin, this is a large fin that goes on the back, and I'll put the paddle together here in a minute and show you exactly, put the bag aside, roll it out. And remember I said I will not be needing the pump. I've already pumped up one board over here. So check this out. This is an electric pump by the same company. To turn it on, you're gonna turn that switch on right there. Here the fans kick on. The recommended inflation on this is 15 PSI. Has six different fittings right here. Check it out. It goes in really tight fit. Just like that. And that clicks on there like that. That has an automatic shut off, so it will turn off at 15 PSI. While that's going on, let me go ahead and put the ankle strap on there. And all these ankle straps are basically the same. Stick that in there like that. Run it through itself like that. Now the ankle strap's on there. So we're gonna let this pump up and then I'll get this thing out on the water. There you go, 15 PSI. And then when it's turned off, you just hit the switch on the bottom there. Take that off. You're good to go. Put this back in the bag. Put our fin on. To put the fin in there, you're gonna lock it in like that. Super simple to lock that fin on there. Let's get on the water. And the overall specs and the style on this is the classic. And the length is 11 foot 6 by 32 inches in its widest point, And it's 6 inches right in the center. So here we go. I got Remo out here on the Swander Classic. So just feeling of this thing. Number one, it feels like super stable. And I'm not like a professional paddle boarder by any means. And I will, I have the large fin on there, so that's why it's not turning as quick, but I'm putting a little tilt to it to get a turn. But look at that speed on this thing, and this feels awesome. Highly recommend this board. And then when you want to put the paddle down, you can just slide it in there. And I can just kind of like look around. You can see the back of it here. Very high quality board for the price. You can't go wrong. If you're looking for a stand-up paddle board, comes with a nice backpack, good paddle, good everything set up to get you on the water. Highly recommend the Swander pump if you get one of these boards because you will thank me in the long run. Trust me. So yeah, that's all I got today, everybody, on the Swander Classic paddle board. Let's, um, let's do some paddling. Woo!